everyone, it's Manish here and in this video we'll be taking a look at on installing the Android apps on your PC. So in order to run the Android apps on your PC, uh, you have to download a software known as Bluestacks which can be bought from this particular website over here that is bluestacks.com. So head over to this particular website and download the uh, app and if in case you're using a Mac operating system, you hit on download for Mac. So once you've got this particular application downloaded, go ahead and install it. It's quite easy to install it. So once installed, uh, you can run the application by going to start and typing in start blue stacks. Click on this particular icon over here. So as you can see over here, the blue stack app is getting loaded up. So once you have got this particular application loaded, you'll see this particular interface over here. These are all the installed apps. So whenever you install any of the application, uh, that particular application's icon just pops up over here. So this particular section over here deals with all the installed application. And if in case you want to install any of the application, all you got to do is that type in the application name over here. So in this case, I'll be just uh, installing Angry Birds game. So you type in the app name over here and then it provides you with the list of um, suggestions. I'll be choosing the first one over here that is Angry Birds Space. And as you can see over here now it's downloading the app uh, onto the BlueStack uh, application. Alright guys I'm finally done with the installation and as you can see over here the installed app icon appears over here. Now in order to run any of the installed app all you got to do is that uh, hit on the application icon which you want to run. So for this purpose, I'll be choosing Angry Birds. So, you know, I've just tried like a few apps over here in BlueStacks and, uh, you know, though this particular application is in its beta stage, uh, most of the major applications work very smoothly and are bug free. So, um, as I said before, in order to install any application, you can uh, you know search the application over here, or you can just go to the mobile market or app store to install it. So if you go to the mobile market and hit on the uh, search option over here, and type in the application which you want to install. So I'll be installing File Explorer. So, um, all right, I'll be installing this particular application over here. So hit on download and once your file has started downloading, to check the status of the downloading file, you can just drag this particular menu over here. So this particular menu tells you all the uh, files that are being downloaded and it also provides you with all the updates and the messages that you receive in BlueStack application. So on the right hand side, you have got the suggested apps which are basically the application which are suggested by the BlueStacks. And what makes this particular application to stand out is that this particular application lets you to synchronize your Android phone with your BlueStack application over here. So if in case you want to export any of the application from your Android phone to BlueStack application or vice versa, you can do it with this particular option over here. Since I don't have an, uh, you know, an Android phone, I wouldn't be able to demonstrate this particular feature. And if you are you know, unhappy with any of the application, you can just uninstall it by um, Selecting this particular option over here that is manage application. Choose the application you want to uninstall. I'm choosing this particular application over here. So hit on delete and continue. Done. So the application is just deleted. So it's a simple and a very beautiful application to use. And uh, uh, this particular BlueStack application is just an Android emulator that's uh, you know built upon the Windows uh, operating system. Yes, it does not provide you the complete Android experience, but it gives you some sense on what the Android apps would uh, look like and how it works. So that's it guys. Hope you guys have liked this video and please don't forget to rate and subscribe and like our FV fan page for regular updates. See you guys later.